Welcome to Stratstone. In this video, we're going to look at the iX1, BMW's entry-level all-electric SUV. Stay with us as we walk through the car's design, technology, performance, and practicality. The iX1 is an all-electric version of the BMW X1, and it's available in two guises, X-Line and M-Sport. The car we have here showcases the popular M-Sport trim, which comes with typical enhanced dynamic styling, sitting on larger 19-inch bicolor alloy wheels. This particular example also highlights a striking paint finish of Storm Bay, which has a light gray, almost matte finish in some lights, whilst when the sun hits it, blue flecks can be seen. It helps this particular iX1 stand out even more. To be honest, it wouldn't be an easy task to tell the iX1 apart from its X1 sibling, especially when it's in M Sport spec. Subtle blue detailing on the front grille and rear bumper give indication of its BMW i-electric nature, whilst the X-Line version showcases more blue detailing on the lower side sills. If we were to have chosen the M Sport Pro Pack, it would get rid of the grille and bumper blue detailing altogether making it even harder to distinguish from the regular X1. Of course, this is perhaps part of BMW's plan to make the iX1 a subtle entry into the world of electric vehicles. Being an SUV, the BMW iX1 is very practical. Front driver and passenger space is excellent, and tall people should have no problem getting comfortable whilst finding that textbook BMW driving position. Rear space is also good with three back seats again providing ample amounts of space for adults and children alike. With the rear boot offering 490 litres, it can swallow a small family's luggage or a weekly food shop with absolute ease, whilst also offering more space than most rivals in this segment. What's more, the practicality increases to 1495 litres with the rear seats folded. The interior on the iX1 is reassuringly BMW, Therefore, it's familiar, smart, sleek, and feels premium. Like many new cars, the instrument binnacle is fully digital, and is blended into a 10.25-inch infotainment screen. Coming from a regular dashboard setup, you soon get used to it. Perhaps because being a BMW, the operating system is intuitive to use and adopts slick attention to detail, such as displaying your iX1 on the screen and mirroring the car when the doors are open or when you indicate. It even spins the wheels whilst on the move. The touchscreen also houses many useful apps, with various smartphone capabilities, media choices and general customization options, which all make the iX1 easy to tailor to your exact requirements. Some electric cars used to have a reputation for being a tad dull and a bit slow. The iX1 is the total opposite. The model we have here is called the X-Drive 30, meaning it has permanent all-wheel drive and produces 309 brake horsepower. This means it's got grin-enticing acceleration, going from 0 to 62 miles per hour in just 5.6 seconds, but it's the initial torque from the electric motors that causes you to be pinned into your seat. It also drives really well too, but then that's to be expected being a BMW. As for range, the iX1 offers up to 272 miles on a single charge. This will reduce the more spirited you are with the throttle, which you tend to be as the acceleration is rather uncanny with its initial torque. Up to 130 kilowatt of charging speeds can be accepted by the iX1, meaning it will take around half an hour to charge from 10 to 80%, whilst an overnight wall box charge from home should take around 11 hours. On the whole, the BMW iX1 is a fantastic, all-electric, entry-level SUV. Despite its electric nature, it feels reassuringly BMW. It's a pleasure to drive, intuitive to operate, and has the all-important knack for bringing a smile to you and your passenger's face. If you want a practical family SUV that ticks all the right boxes, the BMW iX1 shouldn't be ignored. And if the all-electric life is not quite for you just yet, the regular BMW X1 is also worth checking out. If you'd like to learn more about the iX1, then please head to the Stratstone website, which can be found in the description below. And if you've enjoyed this video, please remember to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.